What is a genome? A genome essentially is the book of life. It contains all the information to make that oil palm tree. We're publishing the oil palm genome and it's 80% more complete than the previous publicly available genome. By using the genomic information, we have actually demonstrated that yields can be dramatically increased. And we hope that by making this information available, the whole industry will benefit from this and we can actually deliver additional oil without increasing the impact on the environment. By 2050, there'll be around 10 billion people on this earth. That's going to result in around a 70% food gap over and above what we're producing today. That's going to require more hectares of additional agricultural land to produce that amount of food. That's huge. So the only way to solve this problem is increase the productivity, increase the yield of the land that we already have. That's going to require a step change in yield. It's going to require breakthrough innovation to be able to meet that food gap and put a stop to deforestation. It's wonderful to actually manage such a great, young, enthusiastic team of people who work from the lab, doing fundamental research, all the way along until the field. So what we managed to do is connect lab research to the plantation. We've actually validated that the use of the genome could result in much higher yields and much better performance from our planting materials. We've actually planted our genome select palms and in the first year of commercial yields, they have gone up by over 20%. We had to develop a number of technologies along the way that enable us to basically track the seeds, ensure their quality all the way through to the field and through GPS and satellite imagery now we can really monitor the performance on a very large scale of individual palms in a way that was never possible before. What we're doing now is to scale up production of the genome select and plant it across larger areas and we are trying to incorporate in new traits such as climate resilience, uh, disease resistance and also better harvestability. One of the key things that the research and development team at Time Derby have achieved is the whole integration of molecular genetics into the breeding program. It's the application. The application is not trivial. In fact, the application is probably nine-tenths of the work from the fundamental science. All credit to Time Derby research team. This is going to be a model for how the same approaches could be applied in practice to try to take things through to actually giving increased yield on the same land. The program has sought the basic truth about the oil palm genome and what can we do with it. The technology has been scientifically sound and verified and reproduced. It has led to a more sustainable product at Slime Derby, which I think is a critical factor in this time. It's developed a formidable team of people at Slime Derby who can do very exciting, cutting edge interdisciplinary research, which is competitive throughout the world. A fact that I'm very, very proud of and to be associated with.